It's 29-year-old Leeds lad Manny with his bestie, Christian. I like this, I like, I like that. Yeah, yeah. Manny finds clothes shopping a bit tricky. I'm five foot three, so I struggle with my clothes. I struggle to fit in anything because I'm quite broad and small. It's a really awkward size, so I have to get everything tailored. I have to wear children's clothes. This looks nice. That is very nice. You wear some nice jeans with that. I've got these black joggers. These are 11 to 12 year olds. Ooh, these are a bit bigger. 12 to 13 year olds. Ooh, this would be all right for going out in. Oh, they're massive. I feel insecure about wearing kids' clothes. Like, I prefer to wear like adult clothes. It's a struggle. But his size hasn't stopped this dude from becoming a champion power lifter. I started powerlifting, but after I got ill, I've had Crohn's disease for 18 years. I went from nine stone all the way to five stone in about two months. I was like, I'm not going to die. This is me we're talking about. I'm, I'm coming back. Just, just wait. You've got a nice Fine. body. We need to show it off with a nice fitted shirt, Stop it. blazer. Krish, I couldn't agree more. When Manny arrived at the department store, he really got the stylist talking. I want to see the guns. <laughs> I mean, they're booking underneath that hoodie there. I mean, show us, Manny, what you got. Yeah. If you've got it, flaunt it. I think for Manny, it's all about dressing for his shape. Yeah. And I think no matter whether you're really tall or short, just showing someone, actually, this looks amazing on you and giving them the confidence, that's what Manny needs. Yeah. You know what Manny needs, Luce. So let's skip the mirror room and get cracking with a makeover. This fashion editor and stylist knows her stuff when it comes to body shapes and hot trends. Let's see if she can get Manny walking tall in his first three looks. How are you feeling? I'm excited, ready to change my style. Oh, music to my ears. <laughs> right. Superhero. Da, da, da. <laughs> Look wow. at that body. Like, he is so ripped. That's a lot of time in the gym. Do you ever wear jeans? Rarely wear jeans. OK. When I show you a super skinny, mm -hmm. what does it make you think? I'm quite scared. OK, well, put them on for me. <laughs> When I'm out and about and I look at the clothes, I always think, oh, I like them jeans that are well fitted. I like the shirt that's fitted around the body as well. And for me, I don't really get that luxury because of my size. The great thing about a super skinny for your physique is that they're just going to emphasise your best bits. And what they do is a drain pipe, because they're so super skinny, they elongate your leg. So what I'm trying to do here is take you out of your comfort zone with your baggy sportswear. I'm going to introduce you to the Muscle Fit T-shirt. Here you go. The great thing about Muscle Fit is that it's a really high elastine, which means it stretches. These are quite long line, these tees. You've got a really long torso, and it's showing off that length. So they're great for your physique and for your body shape. If I wore a white T-shirt like that with nothing else on, that is going to make my chest look bigger, where she wants to make his chest look bigger, because she wants to show off all his hard work. How do you feel? I think it's all new to me. OK. But it's exciting at the same time because, you know, well, it does actually look really good. It does look really yeah. good. Look at this. They fit all the way to the bottom of my leg. They're not hanging on the floor. They're not three inches too long. Mm -hmm. These are great. And they're adult size high street jeans, Manny. So I know you love a sporty trainer, but I love a bit of a preppy trainer. And what they do is just going to elevate your look. Just to make sure he's not completely out of his comfort zone, wear a trainer, but just yeah. make them a bit smarter. And as Manny's just five foot three, Lucy's got a top tip that could really make a difference. When you're looking for a trainer, look for a sole that's slightly raised, because what that's going to do is just going to lift you that tiny bit. So these are flat shoes with height. Look, these are a platform. Ah, yes, good point, Kat. I do like these shoes. Oh, you like the They're shoes? Yeah, I do like the shoes. Oh, that's good. I don't know how I feel about the super tight clothes. OK. You work so hard to get that physique. You know, make your outfit work for you and show off your best assets. If you've got a Ferrari, you wouldn't leave it in a garage, would you? You would show it off. Well, there you go, Manny. Show off them Ferraris. <laughs> that is such a wicked outfit. I love, I love absolutely everything Lucy's done with him. Like, it's so simple but so effective. I couldn't agree more, Nana. James Dean rocked the white tee and jeans back in the 50s, but it's still a popular street look that's just super cool. OK, so dark indigo jeans. Oh, these are a lovely fit. They are as well. I think they feel a lot better than the last pair. I like the colour as well. Oh, good. Mm. These are really nice because they're a bit more straight leg. You could totally wear those 
out on a night out because they're quite smart. On a date night, I haven't got enough outfits. I wear the same outfit and I might just change the accessory and that's about it. Next, I want to show you... Ta-da! Vertical Ooh. stripes. I'm actually interested in this. This looks pretty cool. Oh, you like yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stripes go from top to bottom. Really good for your silhouette. Can you put this on for me, please? Ooh. It's a car key. I like that. It's very good for a skin tone. Yeah. I'm actually a big fan of this. And again, that long length is brilliant on you. Because if you have a T-shirt that's, like, boxy and short, that automatically I see what you're saying. Yeah, shortens yeah. your frame. I don't think about things like this when I dress, clearly. <laughs> <laughs> this, for me, just says dapper. You could go to a club in this. Or he could go subtle with the stripy T-shirt using Lucy's layering trick. What I've got here is short sleeve shirt. Here you go. What you can do with this piece is you can wear it on its own, just done up, or you can layer it. What I want to do is just roll up these sleeves because, again, it's just going to emphasise your shape and your arms. Let's do this sleeve here. So what I love is just seeing that tiny bit of stripe, which is just a nice bit of detailing. Do it up. Let's have a look. I would do it all the way to the top. Oh, I love it, Manny. And you know what? Not one of these pieces is from the kids' section. Mm. And what we've done is we've gone extra Even small. Even the jeans? Even the jeans. This whole look I actually really like a lot. I'm really impressed, Lucy. You're loving the smart look. I am, yes. We're going to go even smarter. Casual meets super smart. The first step for Manny Kind. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> Lord! Do you have white shirts in your wardrobe at home? I have none. None? None whatsoever. <laughs> really want to do this all the way up. That is a smart shirt, Manny. That, that is, is a, really nice. It's a really nice yeah. shirt. Oh, that fit is great. So what I want to show you is how to mix and match your wardrobe. So you've got a really smart shirt and you've got a pair of quite casual jeans. I'm going to show you how to make this look even more smart and elevated, but with a really cool edge. It is the bomber jacket. Oh, I bomber! absolutely love this bomber. I'm definitely confused then. <laughs> Shirt and a bomber jacket. Yeah, trust well, me on this one. Give it a go. What I want to show you is, it's kind of a tweedy kind of fabric. So it's quite yeah. heavy, but bomber jackets are going to be great for you because they're shorter in length. Actually, this is really nice. It looks awesome on you. I take back what I said. <laughs> it really, really is really great. Nice. Yeah, I love this outfit. Yeah, I think this is such yeah. a smart outfit without being a suit. Yeah. Seems quite versatile, this jacket, yeah. actually. I'm a fan. You won me over so far. I'm so pleased you didn't put him in a hoodie and a blazer. Lucy finishes off the look with a classic pair of baseball boots. How do you feel about this whole look, Manny? It definitely feels unusual. You show me a diverse range, let's see what the end product's going to be. It's going to be amazing. That's what it's going to be. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> well, Manny, you've looked great in all three of Lucy's outfits, so I don't doubt you're going to love the final one. Now it's time to reveal Manny's final outfit. When he first arrived, he was wearing kid size clothes. But what's he going to make of Lucy's grown-up look for him? Now, Manny, I know you've not seen yourself, but I think we've had an upgrade. I'm excited to see this upgrade. Get the mirror out, let's see. Let's see. <laughs> you ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one, take a look. Woo! <laughs> 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 Oh, I did do it. What do you think? Yeah. Manny, you're in a blazer. Where does blazer come from? Oh, this is incredible. Wow. Ooh. I'm stunned. OK, Manny, as well. Manny, yep. I'm going to ask you a question. Go for it. Look at that guy, and I want to know, what do you see? I see a brand new Manny. Look at this. I came here expecting confidence. Confidence is through the roof now. It's unbelievable. I look a bit taller as well. I really, really do love it. And then jeans. A bit hesitant on the skinny jeans, but they actually look really, really good. They look They feel amazing. great as well. I'm so glad that you're feeling a lot more confident about the way that you look. Ready to go out now, ready for some partying on the town. Lucy has worked wonders to elongate Manny's incredible physique. The tailored blazer is super cool with vertical stripes that help lengthen his top half. 
sculpting his legs are dark skinny jeans which extend down to classic suede navy loafers that tease a little bit of ankle. Oh Manny, you're the man.